Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're going to be talking about something a little different here and there. Because I understand I'm going to talk about something that has something to do with CP, something that has to do with a bunch of things. And what I'm going to be talking about is basically your rights. Um, when it comes to me, uh, I can tell people what I want and what I need and what I don't agree with what you're doing. Um, for example, if my dad wants me to get a sit to stand lift to help, would help him with the transfers, uh, I do agree to that because my dad is getting older. Um, now say I decided to live down my mother's and I don't agree with that. Because, once again, I care about my mom very much, and I love her very much. But, her house is not handicapped accessible for me. Now, so I can say to my uh, person that I had to deal with, I can say to him, Sorry, dude, but I don't feel comfortable going there. And, on the fight, we will step it away. And... If you know my personality and you know my rights and you know what I'm capable of doing, um, you would understand where I'm coming from. Now, does that mean that I can sit there and say, you know what, fuck it, I'm not going to go down my mother's. No, I'm not saying that at all. But if you've seen around me what I have and how good I have it here in this house here, then then if you really want to take the trouble in trying to get that same wife at a different location, that's that's something you had to deal with. But with me, you know, I have everything I want. I have the TV I want. I have the wallpaper that I want. I am working on getting a side-by-side. -side. I am doing things that I enjoy doing, like making these videos. And I had the right to say what I want to say, and I have a right to listen to whoever I want to listen to. And uh, let's just take my friend Sam, for example. She needed 24-hour care, so she had that. She had nurses coming in, training, uh, taking care of her. Uh, she had the voice set. She had the mindset, but her body could not function like you and I can. Um... I can give you another example. I've been watching this girl named Emily, and I'll drop her uh, channel down in the description. You should totally check that out. Um, she's very good at speaking, gives you some good advice. Uh, she definitely is helping me out without knowing about it. And I want to thank her for you know, making the videos and making the time for herself to do that. But if you actually listen to her story, and the pain that she's been in, and the pain that I've been in, we both had the same uh, issues. But she can actually stand up and walk a little bit with me. I can't do that. Now, as you probably know, I told you this in a long time ago in the video that I can care less if I walk or not. You know, I have a walker behind me, and I, you know, I just don't feel like. I want to do that, okay? That is my choice. That's what I want to do. Right? Making these videos for you and showing you what I deal with. And I'm sure Emily put them out there to show you on her standpoint of view what she has to go through. Um, but we had, we had the same almost identical pain with the spasms, the... The tight muscles, I'm sure. And I go to a chiropractor once a month to uh, keep my neck and sh shit like that straight. But uh, the thing is, is that <laughs> when somebody tells you you can't have that, and you know that you can have it, you got to say there, sit there and say, listen, you know, I want to do this. I want to cope. I want to work with this. I want to do this. Like, you got to have the right mindset and you got to put your words down 
in a different way and things you want to do. You know, for example, um, I can give you a bunch of examples all night, all day, but here's one for you. I want a side by side so damn bad that I can smell it. So I told myself, I'm going to earn, I'm going to save every freaking penny I own. I'm going to save every dollar. I'm going to try to do every job I can think of that makes me have an income. I'm going to try to work with my dad, see if we can screw the deal, which is I did do. But we're not capable of doing that right now. But I'm not giving up on my dream. I told my father, I said, and he eventually said, I'm, not, I'm done talking about it for now. But I said to myself, no. I want to learn how, how I'm going to figure out on my own how I'm going to make this work. So what I did was I did a lot of YouTube search on the side by side. So I knew exactly what I was doing. I went down and talked to a dealer. I went down and talked to a salesman. And I said, this is what I'm looking for. This is what I want. I didn't give them an option. I did not tell them what I, uh, what, I didn't ask them for any input. I said, this is what I need. This is what I want. How much is this going to cost me? And like I said, it's going to run me about 14 grand. I, uh, you know, that, that's pretty pricey. You're probably thinking to yourself, why are you nuts? But if you want to have the fun in your life and you want to enjoy yourself, you don't let people say no, you're not going to get that. You're going to prove to them and you're going to show them that you can do it. Does that give you the right to be a uh, ask for towards people? No. But you gotta put your foot down and say, hey, this is what I want. This is what I want to do. And, I, and my dad says, well, how are you gonna drive it? So what did I do? I did research. I have everything I need. I'm gonna get everything I need that, so I can drive it myself. As you know, in this, this in case, uh, Emily, if you watch this video, I have no use of my left hand here. It, it, I mean, I have a feeling, yes, but I can't grip a wheel or anything. So you're probably thinking, well, that's not a good idea for you to drive me. And that's okay for you to think that, or whoever lost this video. But when I get this out of our side next, on next December, I am going to show you, I'm going to show you every step of the way, I'm going to show you how to cope, I'm going to show you how to encourage your parents to give you a better life. Now my dad was always been one of these people, I know that my son have the best life as possible, and trust me, we might fight, but I'm telling you, my dad gave me one hell of a life so far. And I just can't wait to see what the future holds because he's amazing the things he comes up with. I mean, come on, guys, you seen the uh, snow show he rigged up for me. I mean, come on, guys. I mean, can I'm not saying your parents are stupid or your, your spouses are stupid, but I'm just saying that is one smart mother, you know, that's my dad. That's. I'm going to make my son so he can feel like he's helping me out. I'm going to make sure he can earn his keep. And trust me, he has. In more ways than one. And if you watch this video, Dad, thank you for everything you've done. Yes, we might fight once in a while, and yes, we might argue. But you know, when it comes down to it, Dad, you know I'm always going to be there for you. And we might pick on each other, and you may not take me serious on some things, but uh, you know that I'll, there's nothing I won't do for you, and uh, thank you for everything you've done. But anyway, we're going to get back on topic. But basically, if you stick up for yourself, and you sit there and say, listen, you want to sit there and tell me I can't run a side by side? You want to sit there and tell me I can't become a psychologist because... Uh, I don't have money for college. Well, you know what? He, maybe you're right about that. But why do you think? Why do you think I made these videos about my disability? Why do you think I make this right? Why do you think I say these things that I say? 
about pain and suffering and in physical therapy and I said there and I'm thinking well you know what somebody one day is gonna thank me because they not see July you behind maybe behind that screen today maybe I'm fixing you I don't know I put these videos out here to help you to show you not to give up and I'm showing you that you have the right to say what you want to say so I want to take this video and thank you for watching and I really appreciate everything you've been doing liking subscribing thank you for everything you've been doing and I really appreciate it